Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel and welcome to one of my favourite tropic events of the year. So I've been to a few things now with regards to tropic, a few of their events and the leaders weekend is probably one of my favourites, if not my favourite event of the whole year for several reasons. I feel very lucky to be able to come as a leader within Tropic because as leaders we do get a few perks and one of them is being able to attend this weekend. It's usually in March, last year I think it was the 31st of March, it's a little bit earlier this year, but we get to see the new products launched in person. It's obviously on a much smaller scale than the Glammies, which is in September, which is open to all ambassadors. So because it's on a smaller scale, because there's obviously less leaders within the company, we're on table, so it's a lot more intimate. This event is free to attend as well. The Glammies, you do have to um, purchase a ticket. So everything they're doing for their leaders is, is free. Um, obviously not the accommodation, we do pay for that ourselves. We get a few little goodies. We last year i got like a goodie bag that you can take away with like notepads and little tropic trinkets in we get specialists like specialized training obviously that um other ambassadors don't get last year we had a motivational speaker um jazz who was brilliant and very inspiring and very motivational as you would imagine for a motivational speaker um and it's just a really inspiring weekend because you get to mingle with all the other leaders from leader level, which is my level, all the way up to the top of um, the tree um, of the Tropic business, the Diamond um, Ambassadors. So you just take so, I, I, find, I find that I just take so much away from this weekend. It really, um, you know, fires me up. And I find that I meet new people every time I come to these events, the leaders event. In fact, is this my, I think this is actually my, only my second one. No, it's my third one. It's, it is my third one. I have been a couple of times before. Um, I'm staying in somewhere new this time, which is the Leonardo Hotel in Birmingham. It's very nice. I'm waiting for my roomie, Janessa, to get here, who's not in my team, but she is a new leader. She achieved leader in February. And if you follow me, on Instagram, you may have seen that we have been accountability buddies since January. We have a phone call a week, uh, to be honest, we talk most days now, just motivating each other, keeping us accountable for what we wanna do in our businesses and helping us progress. So she achieved leader in February, which I'm so like chuffed for her and I will be in front of that stage tomorrow getting all the photos of her. We actually, no, like we connected because Carl is friends with her brother. They used to be in the RAF together. Obviously Carl is still in the RAF, but her brother isn't anymore. Um, and I think her brother's partner mentioned me to Janessa when Janessa became an ambassador. And then she reached out and then we've just, we've just clicked and we talk every day basically now. Um, so excited to spend the weekend with her. And tonight, I went to this again last year, Jill Eagle, who is like the first ever Tropic Ambassador. She is a diamond ambassador. She's at the top of the tree. She has the biggest, most successful business in Tropic. She is my upline and she is putting a party on, on the Friday night, which is tonight, for her leaders. So I am going to that. It's in the Park Regis Hotel. Um, she's kindly put in an evening on for us all. And it'll be so nice to see some friendly faces, mingle, be inspired straight from the off tonight. See Jill herself as well. She's a massive inspiration to me. And um, yeah, is, is always there for some words of wisdom for me. So yeah, really nice to see her too. And then the big day is tomorrow where we head to the ICC. I'm not sure how many leaders are going, but we're heading there, getting all glammed up, I'm obviously not very glam now. I'm in my traveling clothes and no makeup, but I will transform for this evening, hopefully. 
and then tomorrow a day of training inspiration seeing the new product launch um in person that part of the day will be streamed to all the other ambassadors at home um and then in the evening it is a leaders like gala dinner party and it's a gold theme so i do have some gold sparkles with me so i'll come back to the hotel after the day event tomorrow get changed go back for a gold glitzy party at the icc tomorrow evening so if you are part of tropic or you have been thinking about becoming part of tropic as an ambassador to come to the leaders event you don't actually have to be a leader so for the daytime part you can be a team ambassador um and obviously a leader so team ambassador is one below leader but for the evening part that's leaders only so that's where leaders will get their recognition um and team ambassadors will either go home or maybe do something with their team so if you want to come next year Team ambassador is what you've got to be to come to the day um, and leader obviously for the day and the evening. I'm gonna take you along, show you clips of the weekend, what we get up to at a leaders event, one of my favorite events of the year and I hope you love it. You, you've been hiding in the shadows way too long. Always thought that you were weak, but babe, you're wrong Yeah, you better step into the light Just give it a try Think that it's time you let that spark out You've been hiding in the shadows way too long that 
as a business, we can never stand still. There's always so many things that we can do to deliver more value for our customers, to give them better experiences. Things are always changing, always evolving, which means that we have to keep on moving to stay ahead of the competition, stay ahead of the curve, and continue to give our customers what they want before they even know they want it. And so we've got a few really exciting things that we're updating. Um, and actually, before I do that, I want to share with you a quote by my good friend Richard Branson, which I love. Paint. I then um, uh, taught myself how to do uh, Illustrator. Oh, let's go back to that slide, guys. Sorry. I then taught myself how to do Illustrator and Photoshop and created the next two subsequent designs in 2007 2011. In 2014, I was able to hire my first graphic designer to help us rebrand again. And in 2016 was when we got our, our external kind of design agency to completely transform and upgrade and refresh our branding. But now that we're in 2024, we have a world-class team of sensational designers, photographers, creative directors, and they are so phenomenal that I thought, I think it's time for a fresh chapter. I think for our 20th year, it's time to elevate our skincare packaging a little bit more and just bring us to a brand new era because we've really, really grown up now.
Mm. Um, you know, like really matte finish of silicone filled products. And by the way, when you use products that are filled with silicone, like silicone foundations, silicones are naturally water and oil resistant. They are really difficult to remove, but over time, if you don't cleanse your skin properly, it can actually build up inside our pores and stretch the pores out even more. So that used to be the trend. Heavy makeup, down no skin barrier, unstainable ingredients. And the new trend now, when you look out there on the market, is the complete opposite of that. The new trend now is using gentle, consistent ingredients to really support the skin's barrier. Ingredients that just are lovely and hydrating and soothing. Products that feel nice, that are multifunctional, because we haven't got all that time in our lives, right, to do like so many different steps. There is that real value now in sustainability, in ingredients and in packaging. People really care about that glossy free logo, the vegan logo, knowing that the ingredients that they're using on their skin come from plants and not from petrochemicals. And packaging that is more sustainable, that is minimized in terms of use of virgin plastics. And when you look at makeup trends, it's all about clean girl aesthetics. It's sort of like clean girl makeup, clean girl aesthetics. It's very trendy, I'm very young and like Gen Z saying this kind of stuff. But it's all about dewy, fresh skin, skin that looks like skin. And so this kind of gives you a little bit of a hint as to what we're going to be launching. We are going to be sharing with you one new skincare product and two makeup products. Woo! Two of them are going to be launching very soon at the beginning of April, and one of them is going to be launching at the end of May. So let me share with you the skincare product first because this is my favorite product. Um, this product is all about your pores. Who has concerns about their pores in this room? Who's ever thought, looked in the mirror and thought, my pores are clogged? Some of you have no pores. I can see you with your hands down. You're like, what pores? I have no pores. <laughs> you are very lucky. Um, if you have ever been concerned about pores, it is a thing that lots and lots of women and men suffer from. And let me explain to you why. So your pores are a really important structure in your face that helps to lubricate your skin because it releases sebum to help moisturize and you know keep your skin nice and supple but what happens over time is that your skin starts to lose collagen and elasticity and when that happens your pores become more relaxed it stretches and the appearance of your pores become larger as we age your pores are also able to collect dirt makeup grime and if it gets stuck in those pores it can actually stretch your pores out even more over time leading to more textured skin. And that's something that for me, because I have a very oily T-zone, I used to really struggle with big pores in my nose and just seeing the visible clogged excess sebum in my nose. And I actually get a lot of comments, like lots of ambassadors and customers have been in contact with us to ask us over the years, what can you do for my pores? And quite a few of you in the room put your hands up when I asked you about any concerns with pores. And so I wanted to create this all-encompassing product that can really help to refine our pores. And when it comes to pore refinement, it's really about two things. The first is about cleansing, really effective deep cleansing. And when it comes to cleansing your skin, your skin is naturally lipophilic and hydrophobic. What does that mean? Lipophilic means that your skin loves oil. It absorbs and attracts oil because we have a lipid barrier. Everything that sits in between our skin cells is oil-based. Our skin is hydrophobic in the sense that it repels water. We are waterproof, right? We don't absorb water when we're in the ocean and in the bath. And so anything that is going to be oil-based will go much more deeply into the skin, go much more deeply into the pores and help to cleanse and extract the pores. So by flooding the skin with something oily, it will help to cleanse much more deeply. But the second step is to somehow get an active ingredient so far deep into the pores that those active ingredients can actually help to stimulate collagen production and elasticity deep within the pores to help refine and tighten the appearance of your pores. So what can we do? So we have created the ultimate product that does both of those things. It is a product that we gave you a sample of this time last year, that we have for the year perfecting. It is a product that, dare I say it, is something that I prefer now to our smoothing cleanser. And dare I say it, is my
my favourite product of all time out of anything we have ever created because nothing has ever transformed my paws than this product. So let's see what it is guys. Take it away. Okay, guys. Okay, 
Okay, let's see what your next big incentive is gonna be. Roll the video. Where we're going. That's right, ambassadors. We're about to give you the hardest choice in the best possible way. For this year's incentive, you have not one, not two, but three incredible destinations to choose from. And after a vote in the coming weeks, the winner will be the destination we all jet off to. First up, it's Mykonos, the chic Greek party island on everybody's lips. Mykonos is a dreamy paradise of bright white buildings, turquoise skies, and tanned bodies lining the golden beaches. A horn of the rich and famous expect impeccable vibes, music, cocktails, and local food to die for. Staying at the luxurious Maconian Collection, a prominent member of the leading hotels of the world, makes it one of the most exclusive properties on the island. Its majestic white profile rises up from the rustic stone walls that anchor into the foot of a gentle slope. One foot in the water and with views that extend to the horizon, this hotel offers laid-back luxury in a beautiful natural setting. Your itinerary will include alfresco dining in abundance, a must-do private boat trip to the island of Delos Arenia, the magical island where Apollo, god of music, sun, light, harmony, and beauty was born. Your chance to visit the famous Mykonos town for sightseeing, shopping, all oh, the shopping. All with some surprises along the way. And finally, we'll gala dinner on an exclusive cliff-edge location, overlooking the Aegean Sea in true Mykonos style. All the glam followed by all the party. Fancy living out your Grecian fantasy, sailing by day and dancing by night, then this destination is for you. Next up is Costa Navarino. Where, I hear you say, well, staying in Greece, Costa Navarino is my personal favorite. It's a place you'll find every travel journalist wants to write about. Undiscovered and up and coming, this destination is the cream of the crop. Exclusive doesn't come close. Combining complete luxury in untouched surroundings, making it the prime sustainable location in the Mediterranean. This location is so bougie. You'll only find five star hotels. What? So you can expect nothing but the best. Staying at the luxury collection Westin and Romanus Hotels, these sister hotels will be hard to beat, both on service and on elegance. Inspired and designed by the old Messenian mansions that spring up from nature and create an ambience of genuine hospitality. Enjoy uninterrupted views of the sea from almost every room, not to mention the fine menus curated by acclaimed chefs and world-class spas. Your itinerary will include the full Costa Neverino experience. We'll explore the wonders of the Polynimio waterfalls, immersed in a scene of lush greenery, gushing cascades, and green lakes filled with fresh water. Perfect for a relaxing dip, and if you're feeling adventurous, cliff diving is an option too. We'll discover landmarks and explore the local town whilst enjoying lunch in a very Greek taverna, Gyros and Uzo in hand. Now ain't no party like a tropic pool party. Live DJs, cocktails flowing, feasts floating and never ending fun as we watch the sunset in the horizon. Before the day turns to night and the Mamma Mia sing-along beach cinema comes to life. What? More of the pristine untouched beaches that we'll have all to ourselves? Yes please, before the ancient Greek goddess gala commences. That's right, channel your inner goddess and let her be free in draped cloth and gold accessories. Serenaded by Greek gods, Spartan warriors, holding their swords of course, Olympic torch ceremonies, harp and infamous Greek drums. A night literally made for the history books. If r and r is on your agenda in the most luxurious of ways, then Costa Nav is your choice. And last but not least, oh no, I think this one's my favorite. It's your most requested return destination ever. None other than the irresistible White Isle, it's Ibiza! The beautiful Balearic Island is not just home to the European club scene, lavish cocktails and unadulterated glamour. Its stylish, laid-back, bohemian vibe and zen fueled retreats also make it a dreamy location for those looking to unwind. It literally has something for everyone, which is why we wanted to take you back for an even bigger, better, longer experience.
Staying at the newly refurbished Lux Media Hotel, the perfect place for relaxation and fun in Ibiza, in a privileged location. Enjoy dips in the pools, sunbathing on the terraces, or a cocktail at the rooftop bar, with sunny views overlooking the Mediterranean Sea. Pure bliss. Your itinerary will include, on arrival being whisked off to Sabina, a tropic-only five-star villa estate and clubhouse. For an afternoon of a customization by the pool, drinking hand, and uninterrupted views of the sea and sunset. Described as a place free of time, Sabina encapsulates the electric energy of the island. For the foodies amongst us, we have you covered. Five-star dining in places like CBBC Marina, 100% Ibethan, where innovation meets tradition meets creativity. Or Escalou, formerly a private house and school for children, today converted into a restaurant with a waiting list of months. How about a Fiat 500 tour of the island? That's right, a self-driven tour to the rural parts of this iconic island, with beach stops, cocktail stops, ice cream stops, and plenty more. Hold on to your hats, guys. Now, it wouldn't be Ibiza without an exclusive hire of Nikki Beach for an evening pool party. Prepare to get wet as this night will only get better and better. And after a night of party, a beach day is in need, so we'll head to Calabasa, located within one of the most beautiful coves in the island. A day of R&R &R for some, and the party continues for others. For the gala, whew, we are taking you to one of the most talked about venues on the island, a place for the rich and the famous at Sara. Its concept of natural luxury doesn't do it justice. You have to see it to believe it. Dining under the stars, nestled between the orange groves and around the never-ending natural ball, the scene is set. And to complement the elegance of our surrounding, the honour, the energy of the island, we'll be dancing the night away in true Ibiza prom style with the White Island Orchestra. 60 pieces plus a DJ. What a way to end this magical trip. Well, there you have it. Three incredible destinations, one trip of a lifetime. This is your journey, your reward. Which one will you choose? We just put it aside, guys. We just put it aside. They're all so good. Oh, so we are all back from our very long day back in the hotel room and it's a quick turnaround because it's half six already and we have to be back at the ICC for the golden gala um, at half seven so there's a dinner and a party and everybody is in gold and there'll be the leader recognition but oh my goodness what a full-on day of information I've literally got you balanced on my box of goodies the new glow magazines um, oh, have you opened one? Have you had a look at the Glow magazine? No, I've put my stuff. Oh, I'm oh, okay. yeah, you oh, are. Hi. Say hi, Claire. Oh, hi. <laughs> You'll recognise Claire from <laughs> Tropic Fest. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh, maybe I should get one out and have a quick look. Hang on, let me do that. Okay, you're now balanced on a wine glass. <laughs> So let me try and just be very careful that I don't knock you off. Ah, uh, have look, Claire. Lovely. So nice. Oh, it feels different. It's not like a shiny finish like the others. But here is our new Glow magazine with our new branding or the new packaging sort of print on the front. Look at the back. How nice is that? Inside. Oh, there's the new cleanser. Oh, I just saw it. I just saw it. There we go. There's the new radiance cleanser. The new formulation of clear skies. The new pink electric bloom. It is still called electric bloom, but it's now pink. Our youth potion, which obviously wasn't in our last glow magazine. Oh, how exciting. And it shows you the collections there i'm gonna have to have a proper look at this oh this is really good look it says healthy skin for life's greatest milestones so it says baby teen pregnancy perimenopause and menopause on that page so more information it says about the hero products for each thing and yeah that's really handy actually and then shop by your skin goal. 
So really nice glow magazine that you can get your hands on as of Monday. I mean, when this video goes up, they will already be live because I'll be posting this after Monday. But yeah, Janessa is now in the shower. I think we're gonna cycle through, get, try and pep ourselves up a little bit, make these uh, dark circles go away. My eyes are a little bit tired. I got a bit of a headache earlier, but I think that's more to do with the Prosecco I drank yesterday rather than the long day that was today. <laughs> So I'm going to open a bottle of Prosecco again and just <laughs> soldier on. <laughs> That's how I'm dealing with that. So we will come back to you when we are all golden goddesses and I'm going to go just in case Janessa is naked. <laughs> Cause you're a work of art couple of days later now I'll be honest I didn't look this fresh on Monday that's for sure um, but obviously I'm home it's been a busy few days as you can imagine lots of things getting sorted content creating and um, with all of the newness all of the changes um, and I fully intend to bring a more specific video showing you the updates to the packaging new products all of that, I'm just waiting for Carl to get home. He's coming home Thursday night. So I plan on filming that video for you on sun, uh, on Friday to be up on Sunday. So you're getting an extra video from me this week. I know what is going on, but I didn't bring you a video last Sunday, so I'm making up for it this week. But I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope you're as excited as me for all of the newness. The packaging is absolutely stunning. Um, I have it all. I have the new products apart from one of them. Um, so I'm very excited to share it all with you in Sunday's video. Um, little sneak peek. The reason I am so made up this morning, I had a makeup masterclass with Bryony Blake, celebrity makeup artist Bryony Blake last night. I wasn't able to take part last night when she was doing it live because George wanted cuddles with me and he actually fell asleep in my arms. So I made some notes and um, I have recreated it this morning. So if you'd like me to show you 
how I did this, I am thinking of doing my own makeup masterclass, sharing the tips and tricks that she shared with me to get this makeup look. And what are you thinking of my skin? I may be wearing two new products on my face. I am obsessed. Let's give you a little bit of a closer look. A little sneak peek. <laughs> um, but yeah, such a brilliant weekend. It did not disappoint. And yeah, I am looking forward to the next one, which is Tropic Fest in July. If you are wanting, if you're feeling inspired and thinking, I need to stop just watching, sit, sitting on the sidelines and watching Charlotte have all the fun, I would like to join in. There is still time to come to Tropic Fest with me. Um, the incentive is still running for new joiners. So if you'd like some more information, I'll pop my email in the description box down below. I always pop my Instagram handles down there, come and drop me a message and we can just have a, a call, have a chat, and I can share information with you. No pressure to make any decision or to join, just gather some information and have a think about it. But yeah, another weekend full of memories with lots of amazing Tropic women in the bag and already can't wait for the next one. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to hit subscribe. I bring a video every Sunday. I mean, now I've got George, it doesn't always happen that way, but there's definitely one coming this Sunday. Um, and I do the best I can. <laughs> for those that have been here since I was so, so consistent every single Sunday for a few years, thank you so much for sticking around. And I will see you in the next video in a few days time. Bye.